In this video, we'll go over the basics of using the interactive routing tool in Altium Designer. When routing, it's oftentimes more useful to do so in single layer mode. Toggle this viewing mode on and off by pressing Shift S. In this mode, only the active layer is displayed. Enter into interactive routing mode through the routing pull down menu, the active bar, or use the keyboard shortcut Control W. When routing, you'll notice that the Properties panel will display all necessary information pertaining to routing. The Properties panel should be active whenever routing. To make trace edits on the fly, press the Tab key to pause the workspace. Altium Designer will automatically focus in on the Trace Width section of the Properties panel, so you can make width changes quickly without any unnecessary action. After editing the properties, press the Enter button to unpause the workspace. The cursor will automatically go back to its last routing position. To cycle through the maximum, minimum, and preferred trace widths specified in the design rules, press the 3 key. To speed up the routing process, Altium Designer can finish the last bit of the trace for you. Press Ctrl and the left mouse button to have Altium Designer complete the trace. This feature is also suitable in simple connection areas, where you need to connect two pads directly along the shortest path. Just press Ctrl and left click on one of the pads. When routing, it's helpful to view where your trace can fit and where it can't. Enable the view of clearance boundaries by pressing Ctrl W while in routing mode. For large projects, it's recommended to reduce the clearance boundary area shown, which can be configured using the Properties panel. The interactive routing engine has many keyboard hotkeys. For example, to change the trace layer while placing a via, Press Ctrl L and then select the layer you'd like to route on. Cycle through different via sizes by pressing the 4 key. While routing, use the Interactive Properties panel to adjust basic settings. Press Shift Spacebar to cycle through the different corner styles. Change the routing gloss effect by using Shift Ctrl G. We recommend using the strong setting for the best results. When it comes to routing mode, Walk around and push obstacles are most often used. While in the routing action, press the tilde key left from the one key to view all routing keyboard shortcuts with the ability to select the desired action from the list.